Hey you guys, how are you? Hope that you are super epic. It's your brother Paul. Let's get present. So, <laughs> so I'm just about to wash here. Wash this Ferrari, as you can see. And um, <laughs> let me show you the Ferrari. So, yeah. <clears throat> so I got a question from um, Nabrowski. And he was asking about what does a mental diet mean, right? So I feel like I explain better in videos than I do in voice notes. So I'll just share it with everybody. I think it will help all of us. So a mental diet, guys, is kind of like... Um, <laughs> some people might think it's similar to affirmations, but it's not really some. It's similar in a way, but it's not the same as affirmations. So what it is, is affirmations are kind of like... Imagine it like this. Someone eats breakfast and then for breakfast what do they eat right they want to they want to get fit right they want to get healthy and stuff like that so for breakfast they eat um salad and meat right it's pretty healthy right just whole foods and then <laughs> then all throughout that's the affirmation right then all throughout the day they're just eating like um chocolates and stuff that's like processed not necessarily that all chocolates are like not good for you but they're eating like candy and stuff like that and stuff is like pizza and stuff like that, but just like throughout the whole fucking day, right? That's what they're eating. Um, so that's an affirmation, right? A mental diet is like you have your whatever, your breakfast with like salad and whatever. I don't really have that. <laughs> I don't really eat that. And then meat, right? I do eat salad though, but not for breakfast. And then throughout the rest of the day, you're eating healthy as well, right? You're eating whatever, sushi without mayonnaise. Um, yeah, so that's a mental diet. A mental diet is like you're aware of your thoughts and you're focusing on having the good thoughts. You get what I'm saying? It's not just like, oh, just five minutes of the day, I like have good thoughts and the rest is like 90% of the day is not good. It's rather like, okay, I'll try, I'll have like, try to have 100% of the day good thoughts and then maybe have 90% good thoughts. You get what I'm saying? But then you maybe try to get like 100%. So, a mental diet, you, def you generally like focus it towards something, right? So, let's say you want to uh, get something, okay? Like yesterday, right? <laughs> yesterday, or the day before, I think it was, yeah, the day before yesterday. Today is visualization day five, by the way, right? So, I think on day two, day two, right, I visualized... Uh, having a job, a great job that I enjoy and that I'm passionate about. And during that time, throughout the day, I decided to just practice like a mental diet, right? So I was like, my life is fucking awesome. I'm fucking loving life. Everything is super fucking cool. And just like constantly and felt really fucking good. <laughs> and then I was also like, I'm so glad I have a, uh, I'm so glad that I have a fun, easy, well-paying job that I enjoy. Okay. And I, that was the whole vibe throughout the whole fucking day, gents. And what happened, right? Just as I was about, I, I swear to God, right? Just as I was about, just as I was about to leave, like not earlier, not after, like just as I was about to leave to the store to get some groceries, my phone rang and I was going to leave my phone at home, right? My phone rang. I hear my ringtone. Um, <laughs> Sitting on top of the pyramid with the niggas who be spitting legitimate. <clears throat> Diddy and Eminem. And so <laughs> I hear my ringtone. And then I'm like, I take it up and I'm like, Coco. I'm just like. I'm just like in such a good mood. I'm like, Coco, <laughs> which is basically a knock-on sound here in Africa. Um, and so on the other end of the phone, it's like, hello? And I'm like, hey, hi. And it's like, is Paul there? Can you please put Paul on the phone? I'm like, yeah, it's Paul here. And then they're like, yo, we're calling from, uh, from Pick and Pay. Um, are you still available for that, uh, for the job, the job opportunity? So I was like, oh, fucking awesome. I'm like, yeah, yeah, I am. So... Yeah, I went for the interview yesterday. I think I told you guys a bit about that. But yeah, on that same day, guys, that I visualized that thing, and then throughout the day, I had positive thoughts and positive emotions. You see, your thoughts and your emotions kind of go hand in hand because your emotions are kind of your reaction to your thoughts. You get what I'm saying? Your body's reaction to your thoughts. So if you believe your thoughts in a certain way or you attach a certain meaning to a thought, that induces a certain emotion. 
If you think something's good or not good, if you judge it to be good or not good, you're going to feel a certain emotion, right? Someone says lollipop, that can mean all kinds of things to different people. It can be a good thing or not good thing or a neutral thing, right? So you want to be, for the mental diet, you generally, ultimately, you want to be feeling good emotions throughout your body. Not like always like, look, you can achieve success without, definitely like without feeling good all the time, of course. But like if you want best results, like if you want to just feel, if you want to manifest happy things in your life, you generally want to feel like, at peace within yourself, right? At peace. And that kind of shows that you trust in that you are going to get the things that you want when you're at peace, that everything's good. And that's like the ultimate affirmation. That faith of the peace and that consistent peace that creates a bunch of cool stuff. So I had that the day before yesterday. Got the interview, did really fucking well. I think I did. I'm pretty sure that I got 100% in the fucking exam. Um, what else? And the, both interviewers that interviewed me, they said they were really happy with the interview. Check the tattoo, check the tattoo, check the tattoo, check the chest. So yeah, they're really happy with the interview. And um, yeah, a lot of cool stuff happened that day. So the mental diet, which I'm going to apply today again, I didn't really do it yesterday. Um, and I, the difference, guys, you'll notice is visibly, it's really noticeable. The difference is really noticeable. So yeah, but the important thing, is this being able to control your focus right being able to stop thinking when you want to stop thinking that is the real power So glad I stopped thinking there for like maybe seven seconds or ten seconds or something like that. Kind of not thinking right now either. Just seeing stuff. It's, it's always a good feeling. Peaceful feeling. So that's generally a good state as well to be in. Um, so yeah, so that's basically mental diet. Um, and uh, just saying good things because your thoughts create stuff, bruh. It, it, it affects the the actions that your body takes, the places your subconscious leads your body to. Like if you feel like walking around a corner, maybe there's, there's a reason why you feel like walking around this corner. It's because of whatever you've been thinking and your subconscious is going to lead you to uh, uh, manifest through you um, whatever you've been dwelling on, um, whatever emotions you've been uh, feeling, right? So... That's why you generally want to feel good feelings. You get what I'm saying? Because those are creating. So, but the thing is this. It's okay to think whatever you're thinking, right? Just as long as you're just relaxed about it. Like, don't judge it. If you're relaxed inside, you stay relaxed, you're fine. Just stay relaxed. It's chilled. Then the context of it changes. So the context of whatever you manifest is going to be neutral. Maybe you'll just... Uh, if you feel normal about it, it may just manifest in a comic book. And then you're like, oh, I just thought about that earlier today, actually. But if you like feel excited about it, happy about it, or whatever the fuck, it may be that you get the thing in real life, like a car, or whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? That's an example. Peace, guys. Peace, guys. Peace.